Creepers, this is AZ Man here, and I'm gonna show you guys how to uh, get MX Tube in your YouTube icon. Instead of having a whole different icon, you can just have it right in like an add on in YouTube. So you're gonna wanna open up your iPod and launch Cydia. You have to have a jailbroken iPod Touch for this, or iPhone. So you're gonna go to Manage Sources, Edit, Add. You have to add the source that I'm gonna tell you guys right now. It's called, uh, it's be your iPhone. It's, the source is, uh, http colon slash slash repo dot b-e-y-o-u-r-i-p-h-o-n-e dot c-o-m slash. I'll read that out to you. It's http colon slash slash repo dot be your iPhone dot com slash. That will allow you to, uh, get paid uh, applications in Cydia for free because I really don't want to pay for it and this thing that I'm going to get you guys is it does cost money I believe it costs like $5 or something because it's really good and you have, to go into, you have to go into the search section after you downloaded the source and look up your tube Y-O-U-R-T-U-B-E your tube sorry my cam is kind of crappy but it's the best that I can do so when you search it it's going to come up with two things. It's going to come up with your tube in blue, which has a little, like, like screwdriver next to it, which means a tweak. Sorry for that whistle, but, uh, and they're going to have this one, the one right above it. It's going to have your tube. It's going to be from Be Your iPhone. It's the exact same thing. There's nothing different. It's just paid and not paid. So you're going to open up the your tube that does not cost money. And then you're going to go to, uh, Install in the top right corner. There really isn't. There's no info that lets you that it tells you about it. Here, I checked it. So um, you're gonna go to install in the top right corner. And you're gonna confirm. I already downloaded it, so I can't. So then um, you're you're gonna respring. And then when you go back home, uh, it will not have a new icon like I told you. It will be added into your YouTube account. Added into your YouTube icon. So you go to YouTube. Click on it. Uh, if you go to more, you go to edit. Right there, it'll have downloads. Oh, wait, let me get that in the screen for a second. Right there, it says downloads. That icon right there. I'm trying to make it bigger. See, it's like, I don't know exactly what you would call that. It's like a box with an arrow pointing towards it. It says downloads. So you're just going to drag that to your bottom wherever you want to do it, or you don't have to, but I like it there, so I'm going to keep it. And, um, so then you just go to any video that you want. It takes quite, it takes a long time, so I'm going to pick a really short video. It's called my shortest video ever. It's three seconds, so this should take relatively short. Let's see how long it is. Let's see the video. I don't have a speaker, so can't hear anything and that's it <laughs> so after you watch the video you don't even have to watch the video you just hit done in the corner right in the corner right there it'll have that little icon of the download icon you click on that all right look at that you can download it so it says select quality this video is available in multiple qualities I believe that high quality is using Wi-Fi and low quality is using edge but I'm not entirely sure. Sorry about the slam. My brother just got screamed at. Um, so, uh, high quality, I believe, is Wi-Fi. And low quality is Edge, I believe. If you guys know that, then tell me. Low quality is, like, really low quality. And high quality is, like, better quality, but not the best that you can get on YouTube. But, uh, it's better than nothing. So, if you go to high quality, it'll zoom down there to the corner. Wherever you have your downloads, it'll be there. And mine's already downloaded, so it takes three seconds. It's already downloaded, so you can see it right there. And when after you download it, you can watch it without uh, Wi-Fi, and I'll prove that to you guys right now. I'll go to my SVS settings. I'll go to Wi-Fi, and I will turn off Wi-Fi. And now you've noticed that the little Wi-Fi icon up there has disappeared. So I do not have Wi-Fi on right now. And if you guys see that, it's backgrounded, so I'll turn the backgrounder off so you guys, that's my dog, so you guys don't think that 
Oh, you had a background and it still works, duh. Well, no. Actually, that's not true. So, if I can get my post picture up. And I'll just close that. I'll close everything. Close Cydia. I'll close YouTube. So, now you've noticed that there's no apps running. So, YouTube is not running. So, then I go into YouTube. Launch it up. Since I do not have Wi-Fi on, it will not load. So, it'll just be like nothing. If I go to search. I'll go to search. Prove it to you guys again. Search. Cannot connect to YouTube. Since it does not have Wi-Fi. Cannot connect to YouTube. So, I'll go to my downloads. See, I'm in my download section down there. Right there. And then I'll click on the video that I saved. Click on it. It opens you right up to it. And then it plays it. It has no buffering. And you don't have to wait until it loads. And you can simply delete it by just sliding it and then hit and delete. You just slide it and hit delete. I'm sorry, my finger was off the screen. But just slide it and hit delete. I just watched it without Wi Fi. And that can also be done in MX too, but I believe this is quicker, easier, and you don't have to use a different icon. So, uh, that is my video on how to use MX Tube or how to download um, videos off of YouTube without. Uh, why with and watch them without Wi-Fi? So thanks for watching, and uh, I want to know how you guys like my new angle. Instead of seeing me, you just see the iPod. Someone said that I have bad angles. So thanks for watching, and please comment, rate, subscribe. Tell me if you like this angle better. If you didn't know that I changed my angle, please watch my other videos. And thanks for watching, and peace.